this is an 18th flower? You can feel some slick, oily stuff coming out of its stem. Great! With this, we can fix Scrapper. Wait right here. I'll have him up and ready in no time. Do, 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 do. Phew. There you go. I turned from brown to normal. Yay, I'm doing a robot dance. Of teddy bears. Thank you, Blur. I've got a full tank of energy and I'm ready to carry a maze anything. Oh, it's happy fun time robot land. It's happy fun time robot land. Na, na, na. Huh? Who is this green clad individual of small stature? <laughs> Whoa, it talked! Can you believe that? I guess I really did fix him. This kid gave me the materials I need to fix you. Go on, say thank you. Hmm, are you sure it was him? <sighs> well then, I extend my reluctant thanks to you in a gesture of upbuilderty gratitude. <sighs> oh, no. Hey, now, watch it. That's no way to talk to someone who just saved your life. Anyway, this kid wants you to to haul some some stuff around, and you're going to help him. Hmm. This individual may have restored my operations, but I am not inclined to offer assistance. <sighs> Serving children is very low in my children. <laughs> my kids have to be at least seventeen in this game. That's one year away from adulthood, mister! Master Link, drills from the windmill have, um, yielded a signal that you may search for with your dousing ability. Use it to locate the fallen prop- So this robot dude's not even gonna help us? We spent all that time fixing the robot so you can get that metal thing for the propeller and he's not gonna help us and we end up looking for it ourselves this whole time why can't we just douse for it before why couldn't we just skip the ancient flower nonsense and just douse for the propeller right away seriously that is so ridiculous and unnecessary <laughs> However, it will not be possible to carry the item in your pouch and return to the sky. Oh, that's why. Okay. Who are you? Zrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Ask Mr. Spy to call me, and I will arrive with haste. That. So how do you plan to recover all the stuff that fell beneath the clouds? You know, you could always ask the uh, fortune teller over there. I know he's kind of goofy looking, but it comes to finding things, he's always right on the money. Oh yeah, baby, he's always right on the money. Yo, fortune teller, dude. Yes, come along! Yes, start your Yes, please! I need some information! Um... Treasure? I'm gonna say where to next. Magnificent. Come closer to me. Let's see what I can see. Do you see what I see? Oh! I see many things! Oh, this real! Oh, yes! You are searching for something. I want to gaze into the future. I see. I'm a plow. I want to do. I see a plow. It's during. Look to the elements. Wow, oh, I see. I see mountain of fire. I see a temple on this furry mountain. What you see is just down the mountain. Mm, from the temple. A burning mountain. Such thing truly exist? Yeah, it's called a volcano. That's all I can see. Yes. <laughs> go on, Dad! Dad! Yes, go! Go! Okay. So, we have to go back to, um, Elden Volcano. That's awesome. Alright. Let's go. Well, but first, let's see if Mr. Fun Fun Island is, has anything new yet. I see Fun Fun Island. There better be something fun there. Or else I'm gonna rip off your head. <laughs> I still don't see anything. Sir? Urge. My super wacky party wheel of fun fell off the island, way down below the clouds. Without that, there's no, there's just no way. Dream of fun is dead. I can't bring myself to do anything without it. Laughter has turned to tears. Oh no. Oh, I'm sorry. Um Uh I fell down the clouds. Oh, it's dead! My dream is dead! Uh Aw. Poor guy. Well, I guess this is a side quest. Wait, Fly, do you have anything to say about this? Yes, Master. This place has no name re registered in my memory, and I have no useful debt. Wow, thanks, Fly. That was really informative. Okay, let's just go to the Elven yeah. Volcano then. Over here. Here we go. Gotcha. <laughs> this is the windmill propeller you were searching for. It is not now possible to retrieve this using the robot whose service 
is we have you just have my face set up. You like me called robot? Nah, no, no, no. no, 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 no. I will send word to the robot using telepathic transmission, Master. Okay. Robot. Can you hear me? Oh, here he comes. Do the happy robot dance. Do the happy robot dance. Mr. Spy, I hope you weren't waiting long. No, we we're only waiting here for about maybe 10 seconds. So, you want me to carry this? Hey, Master Short Pants! My pants aren't short. You're in my way here. I said get out of the way. Jeez, what's your problem, mister? I'll be waiting for you up in the sky, so don't take too long for... Okay! <laughs> yeah! Master, I suggest that we also return to the sky and collect the propeller as soon as possible. Okie dokie! Let's go back to the sky! Here! Okay. Oh. Wait. No, he's not wearing short pants, he's wearing tights. Deal with it, dude. Ugh. Short pants. <laughs> do, 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 do. Wait, is that him? Hey, what's up, dude? I'd say we follow him, what do you say? Slow down a bit. Wait, is he following us? Okay, he's following us, okay. Man, let's, whoa, no, let's not hit the wall. Okay. All right. All right, we get through all Mac way, yay! All right, whoa! Yay for all the Mac transportation! Ha, huh, I'm a robot. <laughs> Here's that windmill propeller. <laughs> there, fix it yourself, twerk. Short pants. I'm wearing tights. We need me, Zrongzwaklan. Feel free to call. For Mr. Spy, I will travel to any destination. Ooh, sounds like someone has a crush on Spy. Ooh. Whoa, isn't that the beep old robot gone to this place? Oh, so you're shocked about a flying robot flying around, but you're not shocked about, shocked about a flying blue person who calls me Master? Wait just a second. Is that? It is! That's the windmill propeller! That thing was supposed to have fallen down below the clouds! Are you saying that whole story handed down through Gondo's family was actually true? Hmm. Somehow, I get the feeling this is all some elaborate prick. But I guess I'll try to fix this thing. This goes in here. Can I just crank that a few quick? Mm. Oops, I broke it. No, no. Phew! <laughs> that ought to do it. If you can find some way to spin the propeller, you can probably turn the windmill around. Hey! Hey! Oh no, I just remembered. I'm supposed to be looking for Coquille. Oh yeah, I just remembered. I'm also supposed to be looking for Coquille, but you don't see me doing it. <laughs> I'll do that eventually. Maybe after this, probably. Catch you later, Link. If you happen to see Coquille, let me know, alright? Alright, I'm walking away. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> okay. Now. Spin this. All right, so here we go. There. All right. Whoa. Dude, what's going on, man? All 
All right. So the tower has risen up a bit. So now let's go over there. And I'm guessing we need to play a song. Oh, hey, what's up? Hi. So you went to Spock's Hot Old Pumpkin Chugger, did you? Hmm, he told you that you should do a blow to the gravestone nearest to the tree and then move it to find a monster? Probably just a lot of hot air. Either way, you better off not walking around outside there after dark. Yeah, guess what? I'm gonna walk outside there after dark. The Legend of Zelda After Dark. Anyway. No way, no! <laughs> Shut up, tutorial guys! I'm not, not, not supposed to fall off edges! Shut up! <laughs> uh. Yahoo to you too, Mario! No, whoa, I almost did it again. Alright. Come like this, and this. Up, 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 and up. And here we are. Alright, so let's see. I'm guessing we need to do this. Alright. That needs something glow. And now I'm guessing we need to play to the beat of the thing, right? Yes, we do. Auto tuned herself. Whoa, what's going on? Oh my gosh, I'm lost. Is that nothing more? Oh my gosh, we get to go to a new area. Awesome, Master. There is a high probability that this. Beam of light will lead us to clues as to whereabouts of the three blades. I recommend that you investigate what lies at the end of this beam of light. Well, alrighty then. Well, considering that we're at the 30 minute mark, I'd say that this is a really good place to leave off. So, in the next video, we're going to see where this beam of light leads. See you then, everyone.